16th of june if anyone were to say that just as a person does a deed so is his experience determined by it and if this were true then living the holy life would not be possible there would be no opportunity for the overcoming of suffering but if anyone were to say that if a person does a deed that is to be experienced so does he experience it then living the holy life would be possible there would be an opportunity for the destruction of suffering for instant a small evil deed done by one person may be experienced here in this life or perhaps not at all now what short of person commits a small evil that takes him to hell take a person who is careless in development of body speech and mind he has not developed wisdom he is insignificant he has not developed himself his life is restricted and he is miserable even a small evil deed may bring such a person to hell now take the person who is careful in development of body speech and mind he has developed wisdom he is not insignificant he has developed himself his life is unrestricted and he is immeasurable for such a person a small evil deed may be experienced here or perhaps not at all suppose a man throws a grain of salt into a little cup of water that water would be undrinkable and why because the cup of water is small now suppose a man throws a grain of salt into the river ganges the that water would not be undrinkable and why because the mass of water is great